Hey everyone, let's talk about a free tool that can be incredibly useful when participating in game jams or building prototypes and need some quick character models and animations. This is a quick one. Before we get started, I'd like to mention that my content is powered in part by my patrons, the subscribers of Andrew David Plus. By subscribing, you get early access to videos, behind the scenes content, exclusive monthly video updates, access to join our private Discord hangouts, and more. Mixamo is a cloud based service that offers models, animations, and automatic character rigging. Originally launched in 2009 and acquired by Adobe in 2015, it is completely free to use as long as you're logged in with your Adobe account. Once logged in, you can either select an existing model from the extended library of character models, or simply update your own if you happen to have one you'd like to use in your game. If you upload one, Mixamo will automatically rig it and give you the options to adjust and tweak the rig as necessary. With the model all set up, you can now browse the huge library of preset animations. As long as the type of animation you're looking for is general enough, you'll most likely always find all the animations you need for your games. From standard ones like being idle or walking, to sillier ones like dancing or gestures, to extremely specific ones like crouch strafing left while holding a two-handed weapon or closing a lid with both arms. After selecting the animation you'd like to apply to your model, you can play around with the various settings such as arm spreading or setting the start and end frames to ensure that the animation and model play nice together. Simply export the whole thing to use in your game. Mixamo exports in multiple formats at various frame rates and with or without the model. It even has a special FBX format that specifically caters to Unity. Have you ever Ever tried Mixamo? If not, I highly recommend you give it a shot in your next prototype or game jam. I've used this in several projects in the past, and if you'd like to see another interesting tool you can use to speed up your prototyping process, watch this video here. And of course, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe if you enjoy this type of content. Thanks for watching.